Alright, cool. Man's got some silver there, innit? Now this silver is bare black in that because obviously it reacted with the hydrogen sulfide in the air, innit? And it formed a thin layer of silver sulfide on the outside. But aluminium foil and baking soda can shine it up nice and that. So we just slap the foil into a beaker and then after that we just dash the ring in there, do you know what I'm saying? And then we just pour in a little baking soda and that, you get me? This is an alkaline thing still. And then now we just add a little bit of hot water. You can see the thing bare fizzling and bubbling away and that. So obviously in this reaction, yeah, the black silver sulfide layer on the silver is being removed, isn't it? And it's reacting with the aluminium instead. So it's forming aluminium sulfide, you know what I'm saying? And then when we take it out, yeah, it's bare shiny in that, you know what I'm saying, fam? So we're just going to wash it down with a little bit of water in that, yeah? And you can see the thing just a shine in that, fam, you know what I'm saying, yeah? The pure silver is back in that, fam. All of the sulfur atoms and that got kicked off of the silver, you know what I'm saying? And it got deposited onto the aluminium thing. Now the silver and aluminium metal must be in physical contact during this reaction, innit? Because small electrical current flows through them. This kind of reaction is called an electrochemical reaction, you know what I'm saying? You're done though, man. We out here, bruv, cleaning up the silver and that, yeah?